<laughs> Hi, I'm Sarah Maya Bob Jr., the ant. Today, all the invertebrates and vertebrates have gathered for a picnic so they can decide what group I belong in. Isn't that swell? I'm Big Joe, Saramaya. I don't know what group I'm in either. Do you mind if I tag along? Sure, I love the company. Let's go, Saramaya, to the sky! Hi, Mr. McQueen. My buddy and I were wondering if we were in the bird group like you. Well, let me see. You don't have any upper or nor feathers like me, nor talons, wings, or beaks. The ant over there isn't an endotherm, and both of you do not have any hollow bones. Sure, you have lungs and feet, but the ant eater doesn't lay eggs, let alone anatotic eggs. I'm so sorry, but you don't even live in the desert, forest, or jungle. I would have to say no. You're not a bird, but you could always ask the amphibians. Do do da da do 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 da da do. Hello, Miss Sally the Salamander. My buddy and I were wondering if we were in the amphibians group like you. Well, I do have a backbone like with Joe, yet you guys do not have slimy coats, scales, or red fingers. Amphibians are also ectotherms, unlike Big Joe. We can have gills or lungs or both. You can't. We breathe through our skin, eat plants, lay eggs, and have sexual reproduction. I'm sorry, fellas. I do not think you're an amphibian, but go ask the fishes. They might know. Do 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 do. Hey guys, what's up? We were thinking, are we in the fish group? Like you? Well, as a largemouth bass, I'm an ectotherm like Sarah Maya. Although I have gills, you each have stone. I have two heart scales, fins, and I'm long. You guys don't have any of those things. I eat plants and other fish. I'm a bottom mouth feeder. I swim in the pond, ocean, or estuary. I have sexual reproduction and have eggs, although some have live birth, and some kinds of fish even ha have barbs, inks, and s can even sting. I don't think you guys are fishes, but I guess you could ask the reptile family. Hop on! Hello, Sir Simon the Snake. Are we in the snake group? I would be so up to a snake. But I will help you. Let us see. I am an invertebrate, of course. I am proud ectotherm. Scales are obvious. Dry skin, thick too. Some are no limbs. None for me. I have lungs like you. Reptiles eat insects, plants, and animals. Some reptiles even breathe through their skin. I have sexual reproduction, and some reptiles have regular or endototic eggs. I move with my joints and tail. I can live in lagoons, forests, jungles, mountains, beaches, and some water habitats. Snakes and some other reptiles, like me, can have things like poison, retracting shells, and uh, 
or camouflage to kill my prey. I can strip them. I don't think you're a reptile. But you could, of course, ask the mammal group. Hi, Carl and the cat. Are we mammals? Well, Jeremiah, I do think you're a mammal, but because mammals can learn about every habitat or endotherms and have sexual reproduction. Every mammal, except my friend the platypus, can fly birth. Mammals ha have can be herbivores, carnivores, or herbivores. Mammals can have skin, fur, horns, paws, claws, nails, hooves, or even hands. Mammals have 42 legs, for steam light, we splay claws, burrow, and hibernate. I don't know about you, Saramaya. You should ask some invertebrates like the sponges. Big Joe the Anteater, welcome to the mammal family. Bye, Saramaya. Bye, Saramaya, too. Bye. <laughs> Hello, Dan the Sponge. Am I in your group, the Sponges? I do not think you're in my group. Because you're not soft, made of spongin, vase, or cup shape, or spikes. You're not sessile, or unable to move, and you're not a hermaphrodite. And all sponges get oxygen through their pores, and some filter feed. We live in reefs, fresh or salt water, lakes, streams, warm, shallow subterrestrials. For protection, we use sozoans, toxic sprays, or spikes. You should ask the Nidarians. The ants push out in your belly and out your snout. What are you doing here, little Saramiah? I was wondering if I'm a Nidarian. Well, I have tentacles, a belly shaped medusa, I do not have a head, I can be multicolored, I am a carnivore, I get food through my openings, and get oxygen through my skin, I can have asexual or sexual reproduction. For protection, I have stinging cells and nicotics that fire like harpoons. We also form colonies, usually in salt water. I am an ectotherm, but I do not think you're a Nidarian. Go out to see echinoderms. Okay. Bye. Whee! Hi, Stanley the Starfish. Am I in your group, the Echinoderms? No, because you don't have radial symmetry, tube feet, and you're not an epiderm. Try the segmented worms. Hi. Am I in your group, the segmented worms? No, you're not in my group, because you're not a hermaphrodite, see a T, and you don't breathe through your skin. Check out the bollocks. Sylvester, am I in your group, the mollusk? I don't think so. You don't have a soft body, bilateral symmetry, or a muscular foot. I suggest you try the orthopods. Hello, 
Well, you're the last group, the Arthropods. Am I in your group? Of course you're in my group. We have legs, claws, printers, antennas, mandibles, exoskeletons, segmented bodies, bilateral symmetry, we're omnivores, has zero to two pairs of wings, three or more pairs of legs, sexual reproduction, and sometimes even have sneakers. We live in forests, jungles, salt or fresh water. We are everywhere. Well, what's for the picnic? You!